now the next template is ioib this is the next template what is this template let's understand so let's understand this ioib template this means that objects are also identical and boxes are also identical here everything is identical for example let's assume you have apples let's assume these apples you have a a a and let's assume you have two boxes boxes are also same b b then tell me how many ways are there you have apples are a comma a comma a and boxes are b comma b this is your template here objects are also same and boxes are also same identical objects and identical boxes both are identical now tell me how many ways will be there again there is no formula for this again there is no formula so what we should do what you should do for this so go systematic go systematic way this is what you should do always go systematic way so what will be the systematic way using one box like one part so again you can go in a systematic way if you only do one part means only one box you use then only one way then only one way okay only one way because all the apples will be together boxes are same so it does not matter which box you choose boxes are same so only one way next if you use two part means because two boxes you have so how many ways are there then how many ways are there one comma two only this tell me one comma two how many ways are there for one comma two only one only one way because remember all the apples are same all the objects are same all the objects are same so only this you can do nothing else you can do very simple right let's see this question there are six copies of the same book and four identical boxes a okay a any box can contain any anything so there are six copies of a same book now tell me what will be the answer so there are four boxes it's like a comma a comma a comma a comma a so these are your objects these are your books and you have boxes like b comma b comma b comma b these are your boxes so four boxes you have so this is your ioib template ioib identical object identical boxes a template so what will you do always go in a systematic way so only one part if you only use one box if you only use one box then how many ways if you only use one box then how many ways only one way only one way all will be together all all six will be together all six will be together all these six items will be together okay all these six items will be together if you want to create two part then if you want to create two part then then you can create 1 comma 5 or you can create 2 comma 4 or you can 3 comma 3 only these you can create only these how many ways here how many ways here again only one way again only one way again only one way so this ioib template is very simple right you don't even have to calculate you don't even have to calculate always you will have one way because all the objects are same all the all are apples all are apples it does not matter which apple you put separate all apples are same all apples are same it does not matter which apple you put separate it does not matter just write the cases every case will have only one way the third three part how many three part partition are there if you use three part then you can do 1 comma 1 comma 4 you can do so you can do 1 comma 1 comma 4 go step by step go step by step or you can do 1 comma 2 comma 3 you can do or what you can do you can do 2 comma 2 comma 2 you can do is there anything else 1 comma 1 comma 4 or so step by step you go so this is your 1 comma 1 comma 4 now what you do one you give here so 1 comma 2 comma 3 another situation if you give this here then nothing will change 2 1 right yeah okay because if you give one here then it will change you will you will get c if you give one here then you will get 1 2 3 <laughs> if you give this here you will get 2 1 3 oh no 2 1 3 is same as this so these are same this 2 1 3 this is already counted these are basically these two are basically same so there is no there is no difference okay so finally only one way only one way only one way very simple next 
and left four parts because you have total four boxes you have because you have four boxes so four part how many four part four part so means one comma one comma one comma three you can do or what you can do you can give one here so you can get one comma one comma two comma two you can get nothing else you will get nothing else again one way again one way so the answer is very simple what is the final answer what is the final answer can you create five part can you create five parts no because only four boxes we have only four boxes we have so you cannot create five parts so the answer will be okay four four and three seven seven and two nine the answer will be nine okay so this is very simple now another question seven identical balls so let's assume you have seven identical balls and seven identical balls and seven, uh, four identical beans then number of ways number of ways see don't follow this actually you should follow the systematic way how many one part partition you can create so one part only one one part only one next two part how many two part you can create so for two part because you have total seven balls so two part will be like this one comma six two comma five three comma four so there will be three there will be three next then you can then you can count how many four part how many three part will be there so three part will be like this one comma one comma uh, five or i can do one comma two comma four or i can do two comma two comma three okay so two comma two comma three anything else can i do i think three comma three comma one that also i can do three comma three comma one that is also i can do. so for three part there will be four there will be four for three part and finally for four part how many will be there for four part that will be one comma one comma one comma four then there will be one uh there will be two three and then there will be one two 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 okay you can just check it out right so there will be basically four three three and one so the answer will be 11 so like this you can do very simple right okay so these questions are very simple and if you have seven identical beans if you have seven identical beans then some additional things will be there so you can just calculate if you have seven identical beans okay then then you will have to find how many five part how many six part how many seven part seven part will only be one seven part will be like this one comma one comma one comma one comma one so that will be only one only this you will get six part also will be there only one like this you will get this is your six part okay this will be your six part and how many five parts you will that, that you can count okay how many will be there is this clear now the next concept is integer partition we have already seen integer composition so what is the difference between integer composition and integer partition so you know that integer composition of four let's find out let's find out composition of four what is composition of four and what is partition of four? What is partition of four? So integer com composition, what is composition? In the composition, for example, this is a composition. 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 Next, this is a composition. This is a composition. Okay, so like this, like this. 2 plus 1 plus 1. This is also composition. And then finally, 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1. This is also composition. But in the partition, in the partition, remember, in the partition order does not matter. In the partition order does not matter. In the partition order does not matter. So in the partition, these two things will become same here. These two things will be same here. Just only one. These two things will be only one. So this is a partition. This is a partition. This is a partition. Two plus one plus one. This is a partition. And one plus one plus one plus one. This is a partition. So this is the only difference. There is no other difference. So what is the difference between integer composition and integer partition? This integer composition of n. This integer composition of n. What is that? That is basically a ordered summation this is your 
ordered summation this is the difference this is ordered summation of positive integers okay so this is ordered summation of positive integer and what is integer uh, and what is integer partition what is integer partition this is simply unordered order does not matter this is simply unordered okay so order does not matter here order does not matter here so this is just in this is the partition and this is the composition and this integer composition this problem is this problem it follows what what template this problem follows what template iodb template this will follow iodb template now i told you that what is composition and partition this difference i was telling you the difference between composition and partition so composition is basically ordered summation of positive integers positive uh, so okay so this is the ordered summation this will follow iodb template but you can notice this integer partition of n integer partition of n that is unordered summation of positive integers this will so this will follow iodb template what it means it means like this this will follow iodb template so first you understand the difference between partition of 5 these are the partition of 5 and these are the composition of 5 in a partition order does not matter ordered this is unordered this is unordered summation so order will not matter so because order will not matter so you will have these are the partitions only these partitions you can create okay so for example what will be p5 p5 means how many partitions of 5 p5 means how many partitions of 5 so for 5 these many partitions how many partitions of number 5 how many partitions of number 5 are there remember please please see the difference between partition of a set and partition of a number please note the difference partition of a set partition of a set of three elements how many will be there partition of a set of three element if you have a set okay how many partitions will be there if you have a set of three elements that will be like this like this like this okay so there will be total so there will be one way here you will have total three way and here you will have total one way so there will be total five there are total five partitions but now see if you partition integer partition of 3 means p3 what is that so this p3 is like this 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 is a partition this 2 plus 1 is a partition 1 plus 1 plus 1 this is a partition so this p3 will be 3 only this is 3 only so please note the difference is this difference clear partition of a set partition of a integer partition of a set and partition of 3 this is the partition of 3 partition of n means unordered summation so basically these like these are the partitions of 5 okay so is this idea clear p5 p5 means how many partitions of 5 are there okay now one thing you note that if i ask you how many partitions of 6 uh, are there then how will you find if i ask you how many part if i ask you p6 if i ask you p6 what is that that is basically integer partition of 6 that is integer partition of 6 then how will you find just think about it how many okay because you want this is unordered order does not matter order does not matter so this is unordered this is your unordered summation unordered summation so if i ask you how will you find this uh, how many partition of 6 are there then just go step by step just go step by step like only one part only one part this is the only okay so only one way only one way okay because only this you can create only six you can create very simple then you can create two part if you create two part then 1 plus 5 you can do you can do 1 plus 5 you can do 2 plus 4 you can do 3 plus 3 so 
here only one way right because you cannot do 5 plus 1 you cannot do 5 plus 1 okay you cannot do 5 plus 1 so you can do 1 plus 5 2 plus 4 3 plus 3 this is what you can do so can you notice this integer partition problem is same as iuib can you notice this that integer partition problem is same as iuib because order does not matter so this integer partition problem this is same as iuib yes or no this is same as ioib similarly you can find three part okay so how many three part will be there so you can create like this one plus one plus four you can do or you can do one plus two plus three you can do or you can do two plus two plus two you can do so like this you can do these are the three part okay and then finally for this fourth four part then you can find four part and the four part will be one plus one plus one plus three one plus one plus two plus two this is what you will get and then there will be a five part five part will be one plus one plus one plus one plus two and then there will be a six part and that will be one plus one plus one one plus one plus one so very simple okay so this is your question and this is the complete so this is your complete distribution so remember partition of a set this will follow which template if i ask you partition of a set of a set if i ask you partition of a set this will follow which template this will follow doib template this will follow doib template okay and partition of number and partition of a natural number partition of a natural number that will follow ioib template this will follow ioib template okay so partition of a set we have already seen this doi um, partition of a and this uh, natural number that will follow ioib template and composition follow which uh, which template will be followed by composition of a natural number which template will be followed by composition of a natural number that is iodb that is your iodb template okay so all the variations all the problems we have seen okay this is your chapter is over now this basically like okay this was a long chapter right a, a lot of variations and a lot of things right yes or no like these four templates the complete analysis of these four templates we have seen in the gate 2022 there is a question on ioib and there are many other questions okay and these are these four templates are very important dodb iodb doib ioib okay every standard thing on these templates we have seen okay so like i can guarantee i like almost i can give 99.99 guarantee percent guarantee i can give that if there will be any question in the gate exam that will be only from our notes because every standard variation every variation every standard uh, problem we have seen okay so did you understand all of them tell me did you understand all of them all these templates and all these things